we're back. I'm on my other mic now, so I probably sound very different. And this mic's probably going to pick up a lot more noise. I can't really monitor myself on this mic in the same way uh, I can with my other one. Uh, Hopefully it sounds okay. Okay enough, at least. Um, This is going to be interesting. We might run into some technical issues. You're probably going to hear me breathe a lot more, which is probably going to be annoying, but I kind of have the mic. Let me move it a little further away from my face there. Um, Yeah, so for VR stuff, I got a mod mic wireless, which is a, a like a microphone that kind of... Oh, I should probably mention what those songs were. The first song is a song called Cowboy by Fulgence, and the second song was Pepper by the Butthole Surfers. They're a good band. Um, okay, so... Uh, I needed a microphone for VR stuff, because if you watched my stream of beats... Oh, excuse me. If you watched my stream of Beat Saber a while ago, I was basically just like yelling from the other end of the room at my microphone. Uh, and that didn't really work out so well. And it also made it so I couldn't do like room scale stuff. Uh, I had to be like facing my microphone pretty much. So uh, after debating many different uh, options for miking, I decided to go with this mod mic thing, which attaches to existing headphones. It's wireless, which is nice. Should be good for VR. Um, Now let's see how this shit works. Okay, Uh, let's close this. Of course, my air conditioning turned on right as I was about to switch to VR stuff. So sorry if you hear that. Um, Let's get our friend here. We'll bring our friend with us over to VR. I don't really have a name for him yet. Um, Okay, so the way I'm going to be capturing this, if you've seen people stream VR before, like maybe uh, you've seen mono do some vr streams he's got a cool setup he like reprojects one eye of the headset and then he has his own like uh camera that shows him doing stuff i don't have any of that i'm not this is a low budget stream with low budget memes and so because of that Uh, You're just going to be seeing like a flattened out version of what I'm seeing for the most part. So you're just going to be seeing what's what I'm looking at, uh, which might might be like a nausea inducing for some games. I hope it isn't. Um, I'm also streaming with CPU encoding, which shouldn't affect because I have more CPU overhead than GPU overhead. So hopefully we won't have any issues with any of the games. Uh, but give me a sec here. I gotta like move my chair. I gotta get my headset, the headset on. I have to like get the microphone wire through some shit. Oh, you're seeing the floor right now. That's good. Um, all right, let's get this out of here. I have uh, my old monitor sitting on the floor over here. I should probably move that so I don't fucking kick it and hurt myself. Yeah. Ah. Okay, and then I understand why so many people wanted like a wireless headset for VR because I got to say having like this big ass tether is kind of not the most ideal solution. All right. All right. We got this. All right. Uh, How am I going to do this? Ah. Okay, headset is on, headphones are on, Uh, I gotta run another application here so I can have chat, hold on, Uh, fuck. Yeah, this is my house. 
Uh, you'll notice it's very... It looks computer generated, but I swear it's real. All right, where's my library? Yeah, the grid lines are... I'm standing in the, like, corner of my play area right now. Okay, maybe I'll... Oh, wait, there it is. Hold on. All right, let's get... So I'm still fucking with shit on my computer right now. So hopefully this doesn't fuck with performance too much. Oh boy. Um, all right. I'm just doing something special so I can actually see chat in all of the... See? There you guys are. That's probably good. Um, I can move it around in space, I think. Okay. Oh, boy. All right. So... Ooh. Is there an account in my chat that's just called Twitch? Is that the John Twitch? Where's my microphone? Okay. Oh. We have controllers in hand. Oh, I got us. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Well, that's not what I wanted. Okay, so if you've never seen it before, this is the Steam VR interface. This home setup is, like, pretty much the default home, except, like, it's slightly expanded. So the chat is going to stay, like, wherever I put it. Even if I like jump around and stuff like that. So you can see I got my games here. It shows like Steam Friends. That the experience is actually really nice because before I had the what is this thing called? The uh the Vive. Okay, yeah. So I'm gonna like kinda if I'm facing this way, I think I'm gonna put you guys like maybe over there. I might have to move it when we get in the game. Um, and you can see, I can see my desktop here. Uh, you can see OBS chat. This is the thing that's displaying chat and everything like that. You can see my weird ass monitor setup. Um, yeah, it, you can replicate like any window in VR pretty much with this software. Um, like I could switch this, uh, to like my entire desktop if I wanted to, you just go in here and like, see, I can switch between all these different things. Like if I go to headset mirror, whoa, that shit's cool, huh? All right. There you are. I can get close too. I did have it set up before so that it was small unless I looked at it, but I guess I need, need to change the settings to do that, but we're not going to do that. Fuck it. Uh, there is going to be some weird depth issue. You can see how I have my controller here. And if I like bring it over to the thing, like even though it's way in front of it, it kind of displays behind it, which is weird. Um, anyways, fuck it. The first game we're going to play to check the volume and shit. Hopefully it's not too loud because this game likes to be loud. We're going to play Space Pirate Trainer first. This is probably like my favorite VR experience so far out of all the things I've tried. It's just like really fucking good. Ah. You can see my lighthouse controller up there. The other one's over there somewhere. We're in the void. Oh, my controllers are slightly low on batteries. All right. Um, it's going to be hard to look at the... You know what? Fuck it. I'll just do this. Yeah, game's loud as fuck. Uh, let me turn the game down a bit. Uh, it should be good. All right. 
Um, yeah, I'm gonna want to move this. This is there are gonna be things coming at me from over here. Come on, give me my mouse cursor. Where, where's my cursor at? There it is. Oops. All right, so I'm gonna have to look over here for you guys. Sorry for the the shooting. All right, so I got guns, and you can see I have a bunch of different methods of shoot. I have charge shoot. I got beam, beam shoot. I can do dual beam shoot for, what did I do? No, you fucking thing. Beam shoot for big beam. We got grenades. All right. Let's fucking do this. Oh, and then if I go like that, I got a shield and I got a cool ass baton thing. Those will come in handy. We'll put that away for now. See how to play. This game's fucking sick. It's hard to explain if you're not in VR, but yeah, this game's fucking amazing. No, go back. All right, let's do this. Uh, let's do Explorer for now. These motherfuckers. Alright, so there are a bunch of like different power-ups and shit too that you get in this. Like my cool little drone fella here who's gonna help me out. Easy peasy. Nice. Oh, shit. go. Oh shit. Ugh. 
Piss off, robot. We took some hits. That's not good. Ah! Ah! Oh, fuck. Ah, fuck. All right. Let's try that again. We didn't do very well. I want to get at least to the first boss. Because there are bosses in this. Alright, let's try that again. Let's fuck with this thing a little bit. Where'd he go? This guy's fucking shooting missiles at chat. How's the volume and stuff? Is it alright? Ugh. 
How's my terrible microphone? Do you hear me breathing heavily? That's good. That's good. How's the game look? Is like the frame rate and stuff okay? Because this is my first time like trying to stream VR like this. Because the way I did Beat Saber was totally different. Come on, give me that. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'll oh, piss off. Oh, oh shit. Oh, there goes my fucking screen. I can't see anything. I don't know what the fuck just happened there. My screen went like gray for a second. Huh. That was weird. I guess maybe I accidentally clicked on chat or something? I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna do one more round of this. Because there's only so much fun. This probably isn't a very fun game to watch, either. It's a lot of fun to play, let me tell you. Alright. Uh, hold on one second, really quick. Let me... I'm not going to be able to do that by hand. Uh. Oh no, my mouse is... Alright. Well, there goes my fucking controller floating everywhere. He is the robot. I don't know if you heard that. He likes to tell everyone he's the robot, too. It's just one of those things, you know? Shit.
Peace off, robot. It's hard to explain what's so awesome about this game because, like, watching it on stream, it's probably just like, oh, you shoot robots. Like, what's so cool about that? Ah! Ah! And if I could explain it better, I mean, there's a lot going on that you can't really see between, like, how smooth this game pl plays and, like, how, uh, the fuck? Whoa. And like the haptics of like the gun shooting and shit like that. Ugh. That was weird. Oh, I got a big fucking beam. Got a big fucking beam. All right. Come on, give me this. Whoa. Come on, I need you to be a shield. No. Oh no, this is bad. We got a big boy. He's the robot. Oh. Ah. Oh, there go the frames. Oh. Ah.
Oh, we got a real big motherfucker over there. Oh, fuck, really? Big motherfucker. Oh, shit. Oh, we're getting hit from all angles. Come on, motherfucker. Woo! Oh, I'm getting hit. Not good. Oh, come on, that hit me? Yeah. Whoa. Ah. Well, fuck. Well, that wasn't too bad. Anyway. That was Space Pirate Trainer. Hope you liked that. I'm already sweating because of that. Right. Oops. Don't mind me, my hands just fell off. Um, let's see, am I gonna actually wanna change the the game title and every single time I switch? Maybe I should just set it to virtual reality. It is very cool. It's it is very hard to play too. Uh, it's but it's a lot of fun. Um, let's see here. Uh, let's change this. Uh, no, this isn't the Vive mic. It's a, a mod mic wireless that I got for doing virtual reality stuff. And yeah, it does sound very different. Okay. Um, I, I, it sounded really bad without any effects. I did a new effects chain in mini host. You can see over here. It has a lot less. My other mic chain has a lot more going on than this one does. Um, all right. Let's see. Next. Let's do uh, Gorn next. Gorn is an interesting one. Uh, the weird thing about Gorn is the movement in Gorn. I'm trying to explain it the best I can. Because, uh, you know, a lot of games, either you stand in place somewhere or have like a small... This whole area, by the way, this outline is like my room scale space. Oh, shit. See, I just hit my mic. I guess I should fix that. Um, oh, shit. Okay. 
All right. So this is Gorn. This is like a gladiator game. Let me just check and make sure. Uh, yeah, it looks okay. Game look okay to you guys? I can't flick off chat very easily. All right, so in Gorn, the way you move is if you look, see the um, touchpad thing that I'm pressing here? If you, if I get really close to it, if you hold that, basically what you do is you hold that and you kind of swing your arms back and forth. It's really weird and it takes some getting used to. Uh, it's better than like what Skyrim does, which the thing is, is like teleportation uh, mechanics are like really good for VR games in terms of like motion sickness and shit like that. But the problem with teleportation is if you have a game where you move around a lot and like have a big world to traverse, you're just constantly like pressing the fucking teleport button. All right, so in Gorn, what you do is you just beat the shit out of people. All right. And you got, like, these weird motherfuckers up here. Fuck all y'all. Uh, no, no, I needed those! Uh-oh. Give me a rock. Hey, fucker. <laughs> yeah, what do you think of that? Ugh. Give me that. I need, I need your, I need your fucking thing, dude. All right. Well, all right, motherfucker, you're next. Ah. Your axes ain't shit, bro. I hope you didn't need those legs. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yo, your eyeball's fucking falling out, bro. Alright. Which one to use next? Yo, your arm is, like, gone, dude. Ah. Oh shit. Woo. Woo. So this is Gorn. It's nice and violent. This is like all you do in this game is you just bash people's skulls in. It's a good workout, I guess. Um, we'll do a couple more. Oops. You dropped your ship, bro. And just bash your fucking skull in really quick. There we go. Let me just explode you really quick. Alright, no problem. Oh shit, we got another one. Chat, you need to move out of the way. <laughs> Fuck all y'all. All right, let's do another one. This game is fun. It's stupid, but it's fun. Uh, 
and a wobbly fucking morning star. Hello. You're my first victim. What are you smiling about? You're next. Sorry if I keep hitting my mic with my arm. You coming, bro? Oh, your arm is like broken as fuck, dude. You should have a doctor look at that. I'll take this. Uh-oh. Well. Sorry, buddy. Had to do it to you. Oh shit, there's more. Oh no, screenshot. Oh, I'm hitting things. Oh no. All right, we've recovered. Uh oh, not good. Oh, recovered. Piss off, dude. Look at all these weird ass motherfuckers up here. Let me just hang my hands for a second. All right. Ooh. We did it. Can I pick up my coins? All right, let's do a champion match and then we'll move on to another game. All right, we only get a sword. This guy's got a lot of armor and shit. Meet Achilles, legendary butt fucker. All right. Come on, Achilles. Yo, fuck your armor, dude. Do I really have to hit you here? What do you think of me now, motherfucker? Yeah. Yeah, I don't want that. Where'd his foot go? Oh, shit. Woo. All right, all right. Uh, yeah. So that's Gorn. I've only done a couple of the champions, but... This game's hard to, for me to play for more than, like, 30 minutes at a time, to be honest. Just between the movement and, like, fucking flailing my arms around and shit. Alright, let's go home. Ooh. Alright. Uh, let's see. What should we check out next? Let's do... Oops. What did I do? Um... Let's do... Uh, let's do some of the lab. Uh, I don't know. The lab's not really that entertaining unless you're, like, actually in it. Ooh, excuse me. Um, you can do Triple H, a little bit of Triple H. This is another one that's kind of like, it's more fun. Uh, what? No. 
It's more fun if you're like in it in VR than I think watching it is going to be. Watching it's just going to be like, oh, okay. This game is basically gun simulator. Which is cool. I mean, if you're into guns. All right. Ooh. All right. So you get to pick. Oh, there's some new stuff. What is this? Meat miss. What is meat miss? Why is the launch thing not showing up? Um... Load scene? No? Is the game loading? Oh, it's still loading, that's why. All right, we'll, we'll do a little practice first and then we'll try meet miss. Yeah, this is a good game if you like shoot. You might recognize this if you've ever seen the YouTube channel Hickok45, that's what this is based on. His, his little shooting range. All right, um, this is gonna be in a weird, weird position. Uh, that'll be fine. All right, so. Um, basically you pick guns. Sometimes there's stuff laying around. Oh. Yeah. That was cool. To an MP5. Uh, 30 round. Ooh, 100 round drum. I'll take two. No. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Can you not just fall when I spawn you, please? There we go. My fucking microphone keeps getting caught on my shirt. All right, where's the... Oh, uh, let's see. Right, there we go. All right, let's get steady here. Is this a uh, burst fire? No, it doesn't look like it does. Unless it's somewhere and I'm dumb. It doesn't look like there's any fire select on it. Whatever. Fuck your can. So in this, you can shoot both like one-handed and two-handed. One-handed is harder for bigger guns like this. I mean, it's doable, but... All right, fuck that gun. Uh, I could have put a sight on it. Maybe I'll do that. Hold on. God damn it. Wrong button. Uh, yeah, give me... Uh... All 
Do I need a rail? Do I have to turn this side on? Because I don't, I don't like see. I don't see a dot in it. Zero distance. It's not what I want. I want to turn the side on. Oh, I saw it there for a second. Oh, it's like in a really weird spot. All right. Fucking hot dog over there. Got him. Damn it. Wee. Alright, next gun. We're not gonna stick on this game for very long. Um, actually, you know what? Let's go back to main menu. Um... Let's try whatever the fuck Meat Miss is. Meat Miss Coliseum. The fuck is this? Select a game mode. Target relay. Battle Petite. Meat and metal. Uh, why is this battle petite? Melee only. Huh. Saucer guns. What does that mean? Last wiener standing. Whatever. Sweet battle music on. Uh oh. Do I have ammo? Who the fuck am I? What is this crowbar? I'll just take that with me, I guess. Is this a real gun? Oh yeah, it is. The fuck is going on here? Oh. Fuck off, hot dog. Oh, I'm getting shot. Can you not, please? Oh shit, I'm out of ammo. Or there are more guns. I need gun. Can I reload this? I don't know what the fuck is going on. I'll take your gun. Ah. Okay, well, I guess I died. Let's try that again. Uh, you know what? Fuck that. Let's, um, let's bring a gun in with us. Let's bring a lot of guns in with us. Oops. Take you. I'll take you. Can I take this? I guess not. I guess I can only take two. In that case. Oh, well, maybe I can take more. All right, let's do open and quit. Uh, I guess begin game. All right, I guess I'm shooting hot dogs. This is hot dog battle royale. Just blew that guy's fucking head off. Oh shit. Can I reload? Get in here.
Alright. Where are we where are we dropping, boys? Give me this. You don't want to fuck with me, meat man. Alright, I got plenty of health. See, this is what I'm talking about with this teleportation movement. It's good, but it's like annoying when you have to fucking go around a lot of places. Where are all these meat men at? Yo, you're fucking dead, meat man. Give me that. I need that. Alright. What the fuck, buddy? Oh shit, we're out of ammo. Oh shit, we're out of ammo for that too. Need another gun. Hey, I need your gun. Uh-oh. I just timed you out. Kjos, I'm so sorry. Oh no. Uh, unban. Okay. Close that. Fuck. God damn it, chatty. Uh. Uh. Where's this other gun? I don't need this anymore. Give me this one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> sorry, dude. <laughs> that was pretty funny, though. <laughs> Let's be real. Ah! Ah! How much health do I have? Oh, I'm dying. I'm dying. Oh, I'm gonna die in one hit. I want to be the last hot dog remaining. Yo, where is he? He's like right here. Fucking sniped. I need this. Alright. Whoa! Whoa! Did I win? Oh, I think I won. How about that? Nice. Well, I don't need this shit anymore. Why? Do I, why? Hmm. Hmm. I got a couple guns in my pocket here. Don't mind me. It was like the fucking Matrix, dog. <laughs> Alright, that was uh, Hot Dogs, Horseshoes, and Hand Grenades. We're gonna move on to another game now. Hope you enjoyed that. That game's fun to just kind of fuck around in. Uh, let's see what we're going to do next. Um, I'm not going to play too much of it just because. Um, but I want to show you guys new retro arcade. Oh, excuse me. Which uh, Vinny actually streamed this once, but this game is playable in non-VR mode. Um, and it's like, this game is basically just like a super fancy, uh, like a super fancy emulator front end, basically. Oh, I'm like fucking sweating. Ah, whoa. All right. That's not supposed to be like that. That's not supposed to be like that. Uh oh. Alright, here we go. Uh, for some reason my controllers are swapped. So I guess I'll swap those back. Unless there's just an option to do that, which I don't 
I don't really know. So if you have seen this before, you kind of already know what to expect. I have it set up. Um, I didn't make this setup myself. I actually downloaded this one. Um, but yeah, we have our own virtual reality arcade here. And I can go up to any of the machines here and like say we want to play Metal Slug 3. Let me... Oh, chat, you're going to have to move. Chat, I'm putting you up on the ceiling. I hope you don't mind. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, now normally this is a lot... Eas oh, this is probably loud as fuck, huh? Uh, this is... Oh my god. Volume, please. I gotta turn it down a bit on my end. Alright. Ah. Alright. So playing this with the Vive controllers is like... ...less than ideal. I mean, it's totally playable. But, uh, usually when I play this, I play with the, um... Like the, uh, what's it called? Just my PS4 controller, wirelessly. Oh. Piss off, crab! Uh, cause if you, if you play, like, it's not even recognizing. Uh, if you play with the Vive controller, you use the touch pads, which is, like, really not ideal for this kind of thing. Like, I can't even move fucking right right now. Look, it's not even registering the right press. You can see the joystick, it's like only doing like, kinda, far way. Alright, fuck. That's enough Metal Slug. I'm not gonna play it with these controls right now. Um, let me, let me out of the game. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, there, I have many games here. Many good games. There is one I will- whoa, whoa! Is this like a little fucking robot? No, dude, I've never seen you before, what, what, what's your deal? We're gonna examine you. We must examine him. We'll put him- We'll put him over here. Oh, come here. Do you- do something? My job is secure. No one else wants it. Hey, that's an achievement? Cool. We're getting Chivos, boys. Uh, let's see, we can play some Game Boy? Can I play? There we go. It's very hard to see this screen. Looks like we're playing some Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat, I guess, doesn't emulate very well. Who... who's... is this Scorpion? Why is it fucking jerking around like that? Hell yeah. Oh shit. Yo. Piss off. Okay. Come on, god damn it. Oh, sub zero wins. I fucking rule at this game. Get Get out of here, Game Boy. Where'd chat go? Loud. Is it loud right now? Let me fix that for you. Where am I right now? Alright. Sorry if the volume was crazy. We got laser tag shit here. Alright, 
But there's one thing I really want to play in here. Um, you can also do, like, bowling. You can watch movies in the fucking thing. There's, like, VHS tapes and stuff like that. You can have virtual donuts and throw them on the ground. You can take a cookie and fucking throw it on the table. You can have major disrespect for your surroundings. Um, let's see. I think we want to go into the 18 and only section here. Over 18s only. So if you're in chat and you're you're under 18, sorry, you gotta go. Not really. Here's what we're gonna fucking play right now. Let's get centered. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why I'm getting these warnings. I used to not get these. There's been a kidnapping. It's Rachel, the daughter of the president of Sergio. Oh Get shit. The castle and rescue Ra oh no. Alright, fuck it. Let's kill some shit. Insert three coins. Damn, expensive ass game. Alright. Where are you guys? You guys doing okay up there on the ceiling? Oh, God damn it. Yeah, let's fast forward this shit. Action. This game is fucking sick. And it's actually plays really well in VR with the the light gun thing. It's stuttering. I think it's because I'm streaming. It's stuttering a bit. When I played this before, it was running like perfectly smooth. So. And the vibration isn't working either. It was working before. Kind of weird. I think there was maybe an update, or maybe I fucking changed some setting or something. Action. This game's kind of easy when everything's, like, stuttery slow mode. Area 1 clear. You're a danger. Yeah. Yo, if you've never played Time Crisis, Time Crisis 2 is probably my favorite one, although 3 is pretty good too. Time Crisis is some dope shit. I gotta put uh, House of the Dead 2 in this thing. That would be fun. Oh, come on. Look at that, them fire graphics. Come on. Yo, sick dodges, bro. Dad, you'll be okay up there. I won't let you fall. Oh, I stopped the game. Well, eh, whatever. Anyways, yeah, this game's actually a lot of fun just to kind of chill out in. Like, before going to bed. Let's get some peppy. Oops, I made it disappear. Oh. We got do? I wish it would explode. Diet Peppy? Uh, 
All right. That's enough of that. So that's a uh, new retro arcade. Good shit. I think it has multiplayer, actually. Uh, also, like, you can play with people online if you want, which is a pretty cool feature. Yeah, let me get you off the ceiling there really quick. All right. Probably better, like, right here. Um, let's see. Uh, my controller. Oh, I swapped controllers, huh? Because that game was stupid. All right. Because I were you maybe you were AFK. I accidentally timed you out while I was playing that hot dog game because like I, I moved your, the, tw the chat window was like in front of me and I accidentally timed you out for 10 minutes from clicking around too fast. You missed it. It was good. Um, let's see. Uh, let's do a little bit of, uh, res isn't that interesting in VR. I mean, it's cool for me, but really not really for you. Uh, I mean, I'd say the same about Skyrim too, but, um, let, let's do a little bit of Skyrim just so you guys can see what it's like. I don't know how well it's going to run while I'm streaming, but we'll see. I do have a lot of mods installed, so to make this more playable and look better, I installed a shit ton of mods. I got about like 65 mods running or something like that. It's a, it's a lot. It must have been one of your older messages than Kajos. This is what Todd wants for us. He wants glorious Skyrim. I don't think I'm going to be able... It's the same with Space Pirate Trainer. Like, if you've never used VR, like, you got to keep in mind everything's, like, 3D and very, like, very convincing 3D. I'll be at a little bit low resolution, a little blurry, but... Skyrim's probably going to look like ass compared to what you're used to. So here we are. This is the main menu. Of Skyrim VR, I can look around and stuff like that. The controls in this game are by far the worst part. Um, a lot of the menus and stuff like that use the touchpad things, uh, which is really not that great. Um, I've been getting used to doing like the sliding locomotion instead of using the teleport, because teleporting around everywhere in this game is not very fun. Um, magic and using a bow and arrow are a lot of fun, though. All right. So here we are. We're outside of River Riverwood. Is that what it's called? Look, chat. You're in Skyrim with me. Um, oh. Yeah, my frames are a little bit chunky right now. I'm not not gonna lie. Um, let me see if I remember how to play this. Um, so here's like my quick skills. Uh, probably want to switch to that. So like, if I want to shoot a bow and arrow, I just you know. I mean, it's cool because, like, I'm in Skyrim right now. Like, and it works pretty well. Uh, the menus really suck. Fuck off, chicken. But, I mean, like, yeah, this, this Skyrim, it's a little bit cloudy out right now. There's some weird shit going on with the lights over there. It's definitely buggy. I gotta say... The oh this they're they're closed right now. Um I guess I should wait. Um 
Let's wait five hours. Uh, I gotta say the intro of this game, they didn't change the intro at all for this. So you start out with the crazy fucking, I like how chat's in the wagon right now. You start out in, with like on a wagon moving sideways in VR and it's like instantly gives you a uh, motion. Si Yo, what's that dog doing? Did you see that? This is kind of why I want to stream this a few times because like it still has all the Skyrim glitches, but it's like in real life and it's just, well, not real life, but. How do I put it away? I forgot how to. I did. I did, dude. It's okay. Hello. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. So I did the first quest already. Back to the way it used to be. I got the, the dragon claw thing. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. I'm sure you fucking do. Uh, so we got cool things like the menu clipping into uh, the fucking candle here. Also, my name is just Prisoner because it was taking way too long to type anything in. Um, I was trying to skip through the the intro as fast as I possibly could so I wouldn't get motion sickness. Um, oh, I'm done talking to you. What do you got to say for yourself? It means so much to us to have the claw back where it belongs. I know. Thank you. Okay, we got a nice pot of beans going on. Yeah. Get that bean stew in my mouth. Um, let's see. I can quick turn also, which is nice. So the controls are basically like... One touchpad is used for movement. One touchpad is like interact. The grips are like jump and sneak. This is what I look like. Um... I'm a, this is the only, I had to download a mod to see what my character looked like in VR. <sighs> yeah, I'm finished. Um, these are my hands. Uh, oh, so like the skill, the skill menu is pretty cool. Cause like I can actually like look all around and it's like being in space. Chat's here with me. Look at Dragon talking about his V1 bullshit. No one cares about Battlefield 5 anymore. That was so, like, last month. Uh, I gotta say, this is uh, this game is very... In, despite... I'd rather play this in VR than Fallout 4. Let's just say that. Let me turn a little bit so chat isn't totally in the way. All right. Um, do I have any quests right now? Talk to the Jarl of Whiterun. Visit the College of Winterhold. So no, let's, I mean, we could just explore for a little bit, see what happens. So playing with the sliding movement like this, it definitely takes some getting used to. Oh, I can see some weird, um, I mean, a fucking B. B added. Okay. I'll take you. I do like just pointing at things and like interacting with them. That's a lot of fun. Um, but it takes definitely takes some getting used to to be able to like sprint around. And I have a lot of the comfort features turned off because I'm already kind of used to VR now. At first, it's a little difficult to get used to. There's this fucking dead animal over here. Like, I know you guys can't really see it, but in 3D, for me, like, this thing seems like it's the size of an elk, which is pretty rad. Yo. Yo, don't you fucking try and dodge my shit. Give me back my arrow. Why am I walking all slow? I'm over-encumbered already. I'm level 3, and I'm over-encumbered. All right, let's go into the fucking terrible uh, menu. Let's see, what do I have that's so heavy? God damn it. Um, 
No, we can drop this. How do I drop? Um, I don't need this armor shit. I don't need that. Why do I have all this shit? Oh, I think there was a point in... Well. That's weird. Um, Elite in VR is really cool. I played it on my... I don't want this. I played it on my dev kit too. A long ass time ago. Um, I want to try it for Vive. But I have to reset up. Um, I have to find the cable. I have a Hodos stick to control it. And I have to find the cable for that because um, there's like a cable that connects the joystick to the throttle and that has gone missing. I might have to buy a new one. So the way I have the movement set up is if I press like up on the touchpad thing. Oh, you can only see the touchpad in the menus. So if like I press up like here, it will move whatever direction my eyes are pointing. It's it's relative to my vision. You can change that. There are a lot of things you can tweak. That's the nice thing about Skyrim being a very moddable game and being the game that it is, is you can like tweak a lot of the settings and configure a lot of things kind of how you want them to be. Um, the other thing, like, we uh, jumping kind of sucks in VR. It's hard to, like, jump up the side of the mountain and shit like that. Uh, no. I just want this. Uh, let me show you what, what uh, like, uh, spells and stuff, like, look like, too. So I got my hands, right? You got, like, little cursor kind of things, which is weird. Oh, I'm out of magic already. Magic is... Oh, that's not what I wanted. Uh, magic is a lot of fun in VR, though. Uh, but the menus and the controls are fucking take a lot of getting used to for this. How many porn mods do I have installed? Speaking of that, I accidentally, um, I, I installed a character skin overhaul. And then the first time I played this, I looted some like female. All right. Hand over your belt. All right. I got a better idea. You think your spin to win moves work on me? Think again, motherfucker. Oh, I didn't want that. Yes, give me that. Are you good or bad? So basically I did this and I looted someone's armor and there was Bob and Vagine. And I was like, uh, excuse me, what is going on here? I did not download this. It didn't, the mod itself wasn't labeled as not safe for work. It's just there's a mod labeled non not safe for work or whatever. Yeah, well, let's talk, bro. Mike is done talking. Mike is done talking. You sure? Oh, you're you're not killable, are you? Um, you can also let's uh, switch over to our imperial sword here. Um, you can do this for combat. It's very exciting. This is why I'm not playing melee. What's wrong with you, dude? You better run. Uh, you can't chop off heads. And Skyrim didn't have that to begin with. Your Fallout had shit like that. There's a mod you can download that removes limbs and shit like that. Um... 
But yeah, you can't dismember. At least in Sky Skyrim VR, you can't. All right, let's go down here and see what's going on. How does this look for you guys compared to like a normal stream of Skyrim VR? Does it look like like or to a normal stream of Skyrim? Does it look like crusty as fuck? I'm sure it looks better than like the Switch version, kind of maybe, except for like that crazy pop in that just happened. I mean, these mountains feel fucking massive, mate. Which is rad. I do have mods for some of the cities and stuff like that. Yo, what's up, Skeletoxin? Also, hi, Snackle up. Uh, I should have... I had quality options earlier. Maybe you can turn down the quality if you need to. Can I pick you? No. Again, the main appeal of this is the fact that, like, I feel like I'm in fucking Skyrim right now. Like, this feels massive to me. Let's see what's over here. Haunting Brew Meadery. Fuck you, chicken. Don't mind me. Just doing some chicken stuff. Let's put those away for now. Uh, I don't remember this place. I don't remember this being laid out like this. Maybe it was the mod? Maybe it's the mod or... Oh, it requires a key. Well, I don't have a key. Hey, who are you? Hello. What's your name? This war is as stupid as our feud with Clan Grey Main. I have leaks to sell. What? Just pay for honest work. Get back to work then. I had leaks. Uh oh. That wasn't me, dude. It was someone else. I had nothing to do with that chicken. I promise. Wait. I know you. No, you don't. That's no mistake. You're a wanted man. No, I'm not. Time to pay for your crimes. Here's my bounty. I'll just confiscate any stolen goods you're carrying. Then you're free to go. All right, then. Yeah, Skyrim feels a lot bigger in VR. Like, th this mountain feels like there's a fucking mountain in front of me. I have to tilt my head, like, all the way back to see the top. Hey, watch it. Sorry. Chat was in the way. Oh. It doesn't help that the weather's kind of ass right now. Chill for O farm. Uh, let's look at the map. The map is kind of scary in VR because, like, I feel like I'm floating in the fucking sky right now. And it's, like, a little glitchy and weird looking. Oh. I think that's because of mod, actually, not, not because of VR. Normally it looks a little bit different. I'll take these cabbage for later. And uh, how about a butterfly? You belong to me now. Just stick you in my pocket. All right. Let's see if we can like actually get into what is this? This is a this is a White Run. What what t city is this again? It's been a long ass time since I've played Skyrim. I see someone working in the fields over there. Is he stomping on something? Is he fighting a chicken? Did that guy just die? Oh, I need this Nern root. Oh. 
Yes. What just happened over here? What are you doing? Well, that's taken care of. No thanks to you. Uh, one at a time, please. Um, I tried. You didn't look like you needed help. What did you kill? That big fellow over there? Certainly not. But a true warrior would have relished the opportunity to take on a giant. That's why I'm here. Well, I'm glad you fixed it. I like that chat is just in the field with me. What's the shield brother? The outsider, eh? Never heard of the Is this a mod? Order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. That's cool. Oh. Not for me to say. You'll have to talk to Carl. What are you doing over there? Up in your Vascar. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your worth. If you go to him, the 3D audio in this is really good, but only no, this is not at all near vanilla. I have like 65 mods. There are a lot of things like the 3D audio by default is broken, um, which blows my mind that that could be broken. The audio is really bad if you just start the game by default. What's your deal? Fight with The most famous warrior band in all of Skyrim. Have you been living with the Horkers? When we arrive, oh, the quest is vanilla. And our blades sing to the glories of Eskrimor. This is life, brother. The struggle is what reminds us. We. All right, that's cool. Farewell. Yeah, you too. Um, yeah, there might be some stuff if the frames are crusty for you guys sometimes I think there's like motion smoothing and like some weird time warping shit That maybe I think I only see in the headset. It doesn't show up on the mirroring by Izmir, it's true. A jester, funny suit and all. Just north by the you like to see him laugh his way out of that huh? <laughs> You're well, fucking sounds like you've had quite the journey what, you don't like me standing so close? I got to thinking maybe you weren't coming back. You sound like thought did cross my mind, yeah. War brewing, talk of a riot and Helgen, not now jesters. Skyrim's gone mad, girl. You need to be careful. It's nice armor. Careful, huh? Thanks, Skullgar. I'll remember that. <laughs> yeah, they're talking about Cicero. Maybe. Yo, who you calling little elf, dog? Hmm. I don't want to talk right to you. Strong. Yeah, go walk through chat, motherfucker. It was the stables? Fuck the stables. That guy was a dick. Alright, here we go. Oh, nice little stream here. Huh, <laughs> get it? A stream? Stream within a stream? Oh boy. Alright. Yeah, let's go up. Let's go where the giant real life quest marker is. Halt. What, dude? About. Official business only. Yeah, I'm official. Um. I have news from Helgen. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Hey, remember when Bethesda games let you have like choices like that in dialogue options? I remember too. It was good. Like these doors are fucking massive, mate. Come on, chat. Let's go into White Run. My my White Run is definitely modded, I know that. Oh boy. How long have we been going, by the way? Oh, it should say at the top of my chat. Three hours, five minutes, huh? Nice. Alright. Here's White Run. Definitely modded. They say Helgen got hit by a drop. Brigands I can handle. 
But this talk of dragons? World's gone mad, I say. I agree. I hear loud cats in the distance. But we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. Let's go visit the tavern. What is this? The drunken huntsman. The deadly cuntsman. Oh man. This game is very immersive in VR, especially in like interior areas like this. Hello, friend. In Hello. the market for some hunting supplies? Not really. I thought this was like a tavern. Who are you? I'll be happy to assist you. Blade you like and shadow, silence and death. These are my arts. For a modest fee, I'll make great art for you. Yeah, it feels like you are Skyrim. Oh, we'll, we'll talk another time. I don't want to. I don't want to get in trouble for stealing. You can like pick stuff up and play with it, like you can in normal Skyrim. All right, I thought this was a cool place, dude. Sorry, I was mistaken. Uh, blacksmith. I'll take that. Let me just pick some flowers in VR. Watch where you're going, lady. Um, let's wait until night. Just cause, why not? I wanna see what it looks like at nighttime here. It'll probably run a lot shittier because of the torches. Oh, look at all, what are all you guys doing over here? Oh, look at that cool fucking lighting. Yeah, something's not working right here. Keep walking. What's this place? You don't read that. Some ban bannered mare. No, I haven't seen any romance mods, but I'm sure they're awesome in VR. I doubt- I don't believe you saying that if I sit down, you'll send someone over. If it's no. No. Yes, you want a drink? Oh, someone did come! Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both. Thirsty as fuck, dog. Yo, let's get wasted on wine. Let's get wine wasted. I'll take four big wine. Thanks. Now please, no more questions. Okay. What do you pick up there? Stay away from me, child. Child, let's just sit by the fire for a little bit. Oh, you guys can see what shows up on my filter too. How about that? The filter is mainly for like Vinny's chat. It's not showing up here, but you can still see the highlighted stuff. All right, chat. Let's get wasted. God damn it. I got to do this over here. All right. Nope. Food. Let's uh, eat some cabbages. Drink some more wine. And let's eat some salmon meat. And, um, I guess, uh, five, five bottles of wine wasn't enough. How are you guys over there doing? This is a big ass fire, by the way. Like, sitting here in real life Skyrim land, this fire is, like, fucking huge. Like, these logs are massive. Can I get up? Oh, this is me clipping through the fucking thing. What are you looking at? You want to you want to sit? This is chat personified eating bread. Yeah, why are the seats so close? Bah. I 
enjoy this work well enough, but I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the Inti Solda. Anyway, what do you need? Nothing. Just checking out your broom. I don't want to steal it. What's this? Oh yeah, this is how books show up, which is kind of cool. Unfortunately, you can't like turn the pages like with motion control, which kind of sucks. This book looks fucking huge, by the way. It looks like it's four feet across, but it's cool. Let me put that back. Don't look at me. Look, all of them are staring at me. The uncanny valley of like every one of these people staring at me right now is so much. Look, the lady over there is staring at me too. It's so much weirder in VR. All right. Oh, I can level up. Let's see health. Um. Oh my god, this menu's a fucking pain. Can I unlock this? Requires 30. No. I'm watching you. Um, let's save really quick. Yes. Don't mind me, you guys. Hey, you guys want to see a magic trick? That was pretty cool, right? And cold blood? Yo, yo, guys, chill out here. You think I'm afraid of you? Maybe. I'm out of magic. I'm. I'm dead. Yes. Did it just load my quick save automatically? I uh, guess it did. The fuck is that sound? Mikhail, son, how about something with a bitter kick? You know, there's this lovely Algonian ballad. Is someone yelling for Amanda? Down this road before Mikhail. Save the Saturn sadness for your lady friends. My patrons need light, cheering. Yes, you do raise a good point. What about the sweet lady friends? Someone do something. Wah. Yeah. Someone do something. Won't someone do something? Like, fuck, you cannot best me. Yo, don't drop your drinks. Oh, I'm out of arrows. Uh oh. Give in to the dark side. I have fucking jack shit for mana. I'm just doing like little spurts now. Yeah, tough crowd. I enjoy this work well enough. Yeah. To Me too. I'm thinking of selling the into a soldier. Anyway, what do you need? Careful with that. You like me? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There we go. All right. What can I get you? Where'd my cheese wheel go? I dropped it. Did you hear that burp? Oops, there goes my cheese wheel. Cool fucking physics. If it's work you're looking for, Hoda's the one to talk to. 
I didn't ask you. Cav? No, I guess not. You need more food or drink? Speak to Holder. Goblet. Wanna hear a little Lord Wisdom? Nope. Really know a woman if you have a strong drink and a fist. Oh my god, that coughing sound. Keep walking, soft gut. I'm more woman than you can handle. You're probably right. Peace. I'm trying to have fun in your shitty bar. Okay, I'm sorry. Your peep. That guy is disgusting, and I'm leaving. Y'all are gonna get the fucking plague in here. Alright. Uh, I don't think I'm going to play that much more of this. Because I am getting a little fatigued. By the intense sights and sounds. Of Skyrim. Because I'm not a Nord, you see. I can't handle the, the grandeur. Um, I think I might play some stuff... Uh, after VR stuff, if you guys are interested, though. Uh, it's a toss-up. I could either do some Genesis stuff, or... Statue's fucking huge. I just hear screaming cats everywhere. Yeah, I'm not playing- if I'm gonna play Battlefield, it's gonna be Battlefield 4, dog. No one wants to hear me bitch and moan about the current state of Battlefield 5. Hey, fellas. You hear that? Oh, dude. Yo, that looks... I, I know you guys can't see it, but holy shit, this looks so fucking rad in VR. Yo! I'm not even high right now, and it looks fucking rad. I'm glad you're here to share it with me, chat. Chat word. Yeah, oh. We gotta, can we take a screenshot of this? How do I do that again? There we go. Oops. Nice. Get, get out of there. No. Yeah, sure, quick save. Yeah, I mean, or ever, Skeletoxin. You think I would be a, a substance abuser like that? Just kidding. It's a, not a substance. It's a plant. Excuse me, Windows. You're breaking my immersion right now. Yeah, what's over there? Man, this looks so fucking cool, though. See, like, this is one of the cool things. Like, this game in VR becomes something completely different. Like, you don't even have to play the game. I could disable enemies and shit like that. And this game would just be awesome to fucking walk around and explore in VR. Because it's so fucking cool looking. Immaterial plants. Plants are just a, a concept. Made by society. Let's go take a swim. Uh, I'm pretty sure that is a dead body. Oh, hey, fish. How do I swim up? Oh, like that. Hello, skeleton. Don't give up, skeleton. I'll just take you. Take I'll take you, too. Meat's back on the menu. Oh man, the night sky looks so fucking cool right now. What's up there? Huh. Ooh. Mind yourself. Now piss off, mustache fucker. I'm sorry, that was rude. He did have a pretty lame mustache, though. 
Oh, let's go in the dungeon. Alright, I'm gonna finish up with this in a little bit here. What's up, boys? Yo, can I come in with you? I fear the night. Because the werewolves and vampires don't. What is it? What's with all you guys in your lame ass mustaches? You look like Orlando Bloom. Talk to the yard up in Dragon's Reach. Okay. Any age you can. If you need potions, you should try Arcadia's cauldron. Thanks, dude. What else you got going on in here? Whoa. There's someone down there? Oh, it's just a rat. It's just the Sonic... It's just Sonic from the new Sonic movie. Anyone in here? Any bad guys? <laughs> you alright in there, buddy? Yo, nice wolf head. Open door. Can I sleep in here? Oh, it's owned. Alright, well, I'm gonna find myself a place to sleep. You know what? Fuck that. I'm not even gonna do Ugh, Excuse me. Ugh. I'm just gonna go outside and save. Yeah, real easy to get lost in this in VR, even though it does look a little bit ass sometimes through the headset. Keep in mind, I do have a lot of mods like texture mods. Oh, the rain. Is that rain or snow? It looks like rain. Cool. <laughs> Neat. All right. Let's go ahead and save. New save. And we're gonna go home. Your cat has a bad haircut. What do you think about that, huh? Whoa! <laughs> the stairs freaked me out for a second. I thought I was about to fall over. Oh! Well, that was a nice little romp in VR. Um, so for next time I do some VR stuff, uh, I got Beat Saber, which I'll probably be doing more than anything else. Um, Super Hot VR is really cool. We could check that out at some point. Uh, King Spray, I can do some graffiti shit, even though I'm not an artist. That'll be fun. Um, I haven't tried Rec Room yet. I haven't tried Subnautica or Slime Rancher in VR. Maybe we can do a hand simulator, but hand simulator in VR, you still have to use a mouse and keyboard. So I don't know if it's worth it. Anyway, um, let's go look out at the nice view here. A calm, tranquil home. Subnautica seems like it would be awesome in VR, but I'm not sure. I haven't tried it yet. Hmm. Wee. Uh, but yeah, if you've never seen the Seam Home stuff, there are lots of different like environments and stuff, and you can like play with little things. There we go. Fuck. Backwards C. Well, what else? Do I, oh, that's not what I wanted. What else I got on here? 
That was not what I wanted. Anyways. Alright. This is my bedroom. This is my... My pyro statue. I do... I, I You unlock stuff for your Steam home. I don't know how I'm supposed to get to it. I think maybe there's a menu I have to... Maybe if I do this and go to things. Um, trophies, maybe. Like, uh, I know for, like, Skyrim VR, maybe. Oops. That's not what I want. What is this shit? That's not what I wanted. Props. Yeah, like you unlock shit. Like I can put a Dragonborn helmet in my house that I got for playing some Skyrim. Or like I have a super hot figure for playing super hot. Um, and you can also, let's see. I know Steam Home is not the most exciting thing to look at, but um, you can go into environments. These are the ones I have downloaded, but like I have like a holodeck one, which is pretty cool. And you can visit rooms like with multiple people online and shit like that. The holodeck one's cool, but it doesn't have an interface for uh, like Steam and the games. Look at this program that's running right now. Vulcan Love Slave 2. Vix Lounge is here. Photons be free. That's from Voyager. Huh. Captain Proton. That's from Voyager too. Klingon calisthenics. Anyway. Uh, let's see. Uh, there are some cool ones like that are, these are like photos. Like this is a photo scan of a real beach, which is pretty cool. I mean, the plants look like asshole, but. I can, like, move around, and, like, it looks pretty real. I mean, it looks like it looks like anything that uses photogrammetry, so it looks kind of like Battlefield 1 or 5 does. But, yeah, it's, it's kind of nice. It doesn't sound like a real beach. I fucked up on that. Same with, uh, I don't know if this is a photo scan or if it's just modeled. This one's really, yeah, this is just modeled. This one's nice. Penthouse apartment. You can feel like you're a baller. Even though we all know that um, we're not. Those boats are sp suspiciously still. It would be cool if everything was like fully modeled and shit, but... Nah. Local streamer has never seen real beach. Yeah, pretty much. I live like right next to the beach. Yeah, that's what I want to hear. Sirens when I'm in my fucking thing. Um, let's see. Oh, this one's cool. How about this? It's got the music and everything. Man, a VR Zelda game would be rad. Look, at, it's fucking bloopy. Get me up there. Oh, I can't get up there. I've never actually played Wind Waker all the way through. I mean, I know this island, but... Yeah, it's pretty cool in, in uh, VR. Oops. Anyway, let's let's pop out of VR. I think we're done here. Go home. Oh boy. Ooh. Well, I'm um, blatant sorcery. I haven't seen this before. I guess there's a new single player game that's popular. I don't know. Anyway. Where are you, chat? You're over here. 
Uh, thank you guys for joining me for this VR session. Uh, we played a few cool things. There's plenty of stuff for me to play next time. Uh, Beat Saber, Super Hot VR. Yeah, I already went through all this stuff. Um, but yeah, we'll check it out another time soon. Uh, so let us go ahead. I'm going to take a quick BRB. And we'll see what we're going to play next. All right. Oh, boy. This is going to be weird. All right. That's on. Ugh. All right. Give me a second here. Let's switch over to our BRB here. Oh, boy. Oh, I got to get this thing back up. I got to switch mics and shit, too, so uh, you'll have to give me a moment. Oh, my face is fucking sweaty. Dude, I can play through. It's a long game to play through in VR, I feel like. Um, plus, I've beaten Sub Subnautica already, so it would kind of be maybe not that much fun. I don't know. Um, yeah, if Wind Waker did get a Switch port, I'd probably play through it. All right, um, let me get my chair really quick. Hold on, sorry. Oh, my fucking ass. Oh. All right. All right, we're back in the chair. Face mask is off. Brain is hurt. Um, you guys are going to have to give me a second to switch stuff around. I'll put some music on. Let's close out of Steam VR here. And... Um, all right. Let's see. What are we going to play next? Um, I kind of want to play some Battlefield 4. Although I also do want to kind of play some Genesis shit. Oh, let's see here. All right. Um... Gotta open up this shit. Sorry, sorry guys. This is it's weird to go from meat space to or 3D to pancake land. Um what time is it right now? Five o'clock. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay, let me get a song going here for you guys. Sorry, I'm like zoning out as I return to real life. Uh huh. Yeah, open that. Uh, what would you guys who are here rather see? Would you rather see uh, Genesis games? It's basically like I have a collection of stuff that is from when I was growing up. Um, I have Genesis games. I have some uh, weird games, and I have Battlefield 4. I'd, I'd be down for some Battlefield. Yeah, Genesis would be fun. That's different. I play Battlefield too much, even though I haven't played it much recently. All right. Weird shit I'll save for the weekend. Okay.
Sorry, I got I there's a bunch of stuff I have to switch around going back and forth. Um Mhm. Mm all right, I'll be right back you guys. Uh hang tight, all right? 